Hello guys, I'm going to replace the chute of this refrigerator. When I push this, no water is poured. And if you look here, and here, uh, let me try to get the picture. It seems it seems that's broken yeah and maybe that was the reason I'm not sure but because I pushed it when it didn't work so we have to replace that and uh, this is the package that we received I bought it online I'm gonna provide you the link so that's the port number that's the name shoot so that's the model for this. I'm going to use this quarter inch socket and I will have also this flat screwdriver. Reach it. We also need this plier. I found out later. I put this extension and then put this quarter inch because we need to reach that. Let's open and see what we have. I haven't opened it yet. So, this is the chute brand new nice so when you push this when when you push the the cup the only thing that this does is releasing this switch so nice so we have two wires this red and white so it means if someday it breaks down and you don't have it you can pull this out and put your own switch to release water guys please subscribe to my channel it's really appreciated it will help my channel so what is the meaning of subscription when you subscribe uh, it's stamp of approval to my videos when people search my videos will be at the top of the list so please help me and also thumb up the video and just say simple word thank you or something it's really appreciated the quarter inch socket the metric did not work so first we pull this and then let's pull this out so very easy we have to open this first let's see what else we have That's one, and let's open the second one. First, we have to disconnect the power. That's a very important part. It is disconnected now, no power. And the water that is going to the fridge. So let's tighten it. So I got these two screws keep them safe so let's pull it slowly and see what happens 
so it doesn't need any force or anything. Uh -huh. And we have this wire. Let's just hold it from this side and remove it. And then the other one, the second one. And then also we have here the third one as well. So these are such that you will not make mistake. So that's the part we are going to replace this one, this whole piece. We have one screw here, this wire, the other one, and the third one. I put this extension and then put this quarter inch because we need to reach that. But anyway, so let's open this first. green is done, the second one so I have to be careful what is holding it and then the last one So here, I remove three screws. So now this is totally loose. Okay. And before I do anything, let's have a look at this. As you can see, we don't have this piece coming with this. So we have to remove that and put it in here. With that wire, we have to remove it. So I'm just pushing this, uh, pressing it, when you press it, it can be, it can get out, that's it, so that piece is out. This can be removed from here, so if I push this, so we don't need even a screwdriver, very dirty, so this piece, pay attention that how it was located and then this is a water pipe easily this piece is now free we have brand new here and this is the old one so you see the old is like this and the brand new is down so the first thing we will insert the water now let's just insert it, that's as easy as that, and then we will have to push this pipe in this hole, in this path. Let's make sure that this is inserted into that hole, so it is being held there. insert this side in here because this must go first and then insert and then put the other side so first put this side this goes underneath it doesn't need screw and then it will go like this very easily so now I'm gonna So this is the easiest one, let's just put that first, 
as well. So this is plastic and it doesn't need to be tightened such that it might be broken as soon as you feel some pressure, that's enough. Now this is done, now this is done. I wash this, make sure this piece is up and then these two tips go into this, those two holes and that's it we put the same wires back one goes in here so one goes in here the two goes one in here one in here so you will never make mistake they are very good type of connectors different each is different each connector has different shapes so they won't fit so all the three wires have been connected as you can see here, this has a tip going up, meaning this should come from the top. You see this? This goes on top of that like this. So, putting it at an angle like this, it has an angle, and then and I have to make sure that this side sets but this side you can see I have to make sure that this space is gone now I got problem with this side so when I insert this the other so now I have to put it up, make sure I'm holding this side and this side. No. Yes. So. And as you can see, there is no gap. So. Now let's put these screws Got nothing! So Let's plug the power and see. Oh, Bismillah. So, I heard the flap. The flap was from the thing, went up. Let's now open up the water.
so water is fully opened okay so it is on let's just get a cup and see let's see now it pours water perfect oh my wife would love this because for the past like a week she's just drinking from the tap water and she says it's not tasty by the way we get the best tasty water ever we love this we can't live without this anyways so let's put this back and put this back i want to make sure everything worked so guys uh, guys please subscribe to my channel it's really appreciated it will help my channel so what is the meaning of subscription when you subscribe uh, it's stamp of approval to my videos when people search my videos will be at the top of the list so please help me and also thumb up the video and just say simple word thank you or something it's really appreciated I have a Maytag refrigerator that's what they call the French door refrigerator with the top and bottom so here's the problem when I press the power this is what it does all the lights go on the air condition the refrigerator is now not working any of these buttons when I press this is what happens so 